And so for today's video, I have another cosplay related video. I am very excited for this video since I haven't done one of these videos in a, in a long time. It feels really good to get another costume than getting fashion related items. I don't know why. I haven't cosplayed in a long time, but since the Suicide Squad will be coming out soon, I might have another video before the movie comes out, so stay tuned for that. But for now, I'm gonna be showing you this costume that I got from AliExpress. So it's my first time buying from AliExpress. I got this Hu Tao costume, and if you guys don't know who she is, it's from this game Genshin Impact, and I've been playing that for like a year now. And I am so addicted to this game. And Hu Tao is my very favorite character. So, obviously I have to cosplay her. I did open my package already just to make sure that it's the right thing. And all of the pieces are in. So I have here the costume, the hat, the wig, and the wig cap. Where should we start? I'm so excited for the wig. I got this on a sale actually. It's was around $55 originally $70 for the whole thing so I saved about $20 but let's see how the quality is so first I'm gonna show you is the hat oh there was a lot of things in that hat oh no it fell not bad it's a little squish but you know we could fix that it smells like something but it doesn't smell fishy, so it's good. <laughs> Whenever I buy something from China, it usually smells a little fishy. But this one smells like from the factory, but it doesn't smell anything bad. I'm guessing this is for the outfit. It's actually pretty well made. But it looks like they just glued it on. There's like glue pieces hanging and I just have to rip it off so it doesn't look bad but the details look pretty good I'm impressed so far I love the tassels I'm not sure where this goes so I'm gonna look for a reference picture of Hu Tao yes look at that this looks really nice you can see the glue you can see the glue piece hanging so there's two of those more little pieces it's got clips on the back another one and another tassel that has a clip they included socks it's more like a stocking material but thicker the main costume i got a large so first we have here the collar and then the shorts kind of looks cheap to be honest but you know it has the details on the side which is not bad these ones feel like they just paste it on and then this one is stitched and then the main costume it does not look bad i am impressed so far for 50 dollars where can you find a costume for that cheap and it's made really well like look at that they're not like embossed but they're just printed on but it still, it still looks really good. All the details though, look at that. I'm gonna save the wig for later since I'm gonna try the costume on first and I'll be right back. So I got almost everything on except for the wig. Now I'm gonna tell you all the bad things first and I'm gonna tell you the good things about this costume. So when I was looking for a reference picture of Hu Tao, I've noticed that this logo over here is actually s supposed to be the opposite way. And putting all of these things on, I didn't like because it just takes a lot of time to figure out where each of the piece goes. And one more thing is that it has Velcro. So it easily, it can easily come undone if I just pull this a little bit one more thing is that when I pinned these pieces over here since the color of this is printed on it kind of ruined it when it pulled it pulled one stitch over here I don't know if you could see it 
there's also one over here but for the price i really love it it's very detailed one more thing i didn't like about this is that the shorts isn't even this side is longer than this side so i have to pull this up just so it's even so one thing i'm gonna probably do about this costume is maybe put some hooks underneath here so it doesn't come undone i don't know about this i'll probably just edit my pictures if i do take pictures with this costume also oh my gosh you see that it just happened right now also they didn't give me instructions on how to put it all together so i don't know where this should go I don't know where this is supposed to go. I've checked Hutao's photo and I can't see these pieces. Let's move on to the wig. I love trying on wigs because I feel like a different person. Well, obviously I'm wearing a costume so I already feel like a di different person. But it's just something about different hairstyles that makes me even happier. First of all, I love that they gave me a wig cap. This is one heavy wig. Hu Tao's hair is really long. It's kind of brownish red. Ooh, and I can see that it has a gradient. It has a darker reddish color and then it goes to a lighter red. I really like what's underneath the wig. It doesn't look cheap at all. So this is the first part of the wig. It's just the base. Oh my gosh, look at those bangs. It's so long on me, I have to fix it. it. Looks like I need to trim this. It's very long. The short hair doesn't look good on me. Kind of looks more like Zhang Li. <laughs> but we have to put on the pigtails to make it look like Hu Tao officially. Look how long this is. Uh, I hope it doesn't get tangled. Based on the look of it, it looks like it's about to get tangled real fast. Is it supposed to be that high? Oh no, I think it's supposed to be on the back. But how do I put the hat? The hat barely fits my head. I have a huge head. So how do I put the hat on? I guess it's gonna have to go like that. That does not look right. Oh! <laughs> Almost fell. I guess I just put it like this. Oh, by the way, it doesn't have that zigzag pattern on the back. It's just all straight. Which is fine, I mean... It's like very affordable. If you buy it with a costume if you want to buy the zigzag wig one i think it's like 30 dollars how does it look definitely need to trim these bangs overall i'm super impressed with this because super affordable and i love the details on it overall this costume is really great i love it there are some things that i don't like of course but for $50, it's a really nice costume and I would definitely recommend it to you guys if you're planning to get purchase this item. If you guys want to see me stream in this costume or if you just want to follow me on Twitch because I play there and I'm over there most of the time now, follow me on Twitch. I will leave my link over here and also down in the description box and I hope you guys enjoyed this content, this costume review. Give it a like if you did and don't forget to subscribe if you still haven't yet. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!